Hello, I'm Dr. Brian Caputo, president of College of DuPage. I want to welcome you to our first ever STEM week. The importance of education in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, otherwise known as STEM, cannot be emphasized enough. Students who pursue these fields gain the skills to understand and solve the complex challenges of our world. Just think about your participation tonight. The technology you are using was created by people who pursued a STEM-related career. What was once considered science fiction is now a reality. And it will take STEM skills to turn today's dreams into tomorrow's discoveries. College of DuPage is committed to STEM education. In 2019, COD led all local institutions of higher education in STEM degree and certificate completion. This fact may surprise some people who would not consider a community college when selecting a school for a STEM-related major. But I assure you that COD is an excellent place to build skills in science and technology. This week, you will hear from our faculty, learn more about exciting career options, and uncover the physics of baseball during a live webinar with Alan Nathan, Professor Emeritus of Physics from the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. We are excited to provide you with these opportunities during our inaugural STEM week. Enjoy learning more about these fields and how College of DuPage provides the best foundation in STEM education. Hello there, I'm Professor Steve Santello. Come on in, welcome to my crib. I want to show you guys first these, these development stations, they're collaboration stations that up to four students work on at a time. They, they design projects here, they develop the projects here. This is one of the projects that, that a group of four students developed in about three months. It's a top-down bullet hell game. I'm terrible at this game, it's, it's incredibly difficult, but it's playable on, on all sorts of different controllers. We of course also have all the latest and greatest game consoles. We have PlayStation 4, we have Xbox One, we have Nintendo Switch. We're definitely gonna be getting a lot of the new systems when they're coming out. And they use these systems like this to do research and to, to play test games that have already been released. But we also have development kits for Sony PlayStation and Switch so students can develop on those too. So this is a first person shooter. This is really meant for a keyboard and mouse uh, and it's a really high octane shooter. It's, it's uh, again another great game that was developed by uh, a small team of students and in, in just you know a couple months which is, uh, which is awesome and fantastic. Games like this, we, we end up using Unreal Engine, which I'll show you guys later on when we start walking to see some of these other machines as well. This is a really cool project. This is a VR game that was developed in Unreal. Within, within a couple months as well, a, a group of four students not only developed this, but won the, uh, the Illinois State and National Competition at Skills USA. And you can play this on VR. You know, you can just put this headset on here, use motion controls here, and it's a, it's a, you know, again, great game. Um, as opposed to some of these 3D games, we also do some 2D games too. And so this is one of these these awesome uh, 2D games where you're a monkey flying in a banana, shooting a bunch of things, which is which is fantastic. Um, and this game too can, can be played on all sorts of different controls as well. Back here we actually have a bunch of stations that, that game development students can work on simultaneously. And each one of these stations have, have dual monitors on them so students can 
can work in multiple pieces of software um, as, they, as they want, or as many pieces of software as they want. We can actually hold up to 16 game development students uh, at once, and all those game development students can be working on different projects at once, or even the same projects at once. And you know, here uh, on these dual monitors displayed, we have Unreal Engine, that is made by Epic Games. Uh, College of DuPage is actually a partner of Epic Games, which is really cool. And we use uh, Unreal Engine to, to actually develop most of our game content. We can do 2D games, we can do 3D games, we can do VR with it, we can do AR with it, augmented reality, which is something that we hadn't seen in this classroom yet, but we're working on that as well. We've, uh, we also have other pieces of software like Substance Painter that you guys can see here as well where students can use drawing tablets to, to, to do detailed sculpts of, of their models that they would create in 3D Studio Max or Maya and then continue to paint some really awesome materials um, onto, those, onto those models as well. As part of these stations too, we actually do in fact have these, these game pads here. So we have some Xbox controllers here as well so students can practice developing games not only for keyboard and mouse, but for game pads as well. All right, I've invited you to my lab. I've shown you around, I've showed you game projects, I've showed you hardware, I've showed you software. I gotta get back to work, you guys gotta go. See you later. Speaking of VR, we are currently building an augmented reality virtual reality lab on the third floor of the BIC. So as opposed to this lab that can only house a, a couple of VR units at once, we can actually uh, house up to 10 VR units in that lab and multiple development teams can work on 10 different VR games all at once, which is awesome, it's fantastic. On top of that, we can also test all sorts of different VR products and AR products that are not only developed by our students, but also exist out in the real world. Engineering is all around us. Every day, everywhere we go, we can see and touch something that has been designed by an engineer. But what does it mean to study engineering? An engineering student studies computers and programming. An engineering student studies science and physics, math, and learns to understand calculus. And most of all, an engineering student is curious about shaping the world. If you're one of these people, the engineering program at College of DuPage is waiting for you. The huge advantages of COD's engineering program is we have all the courses that you need and it's, it's a better experience. The other thing is that all the professors here came here because they love to teach. We have a whole bunch of different types of engineering, mechanical, civil, and electrical, which are the big three, but we also do industrial engineering, biomedical engineering, and chemical engineering. We are able to offer pretty much all of the freshman and sophomore coursework that any major university would offer. Students should expect to get a very rigorous and well-founded education that will help prepare them to succeed. Students studying engineering at College of DuPage sharpen the skills they'll need to be successful in transferring and completing a bachelor's degree in their chosen area of study. Instructors are dedicated to providing resources and making sure each student understands course material. College of DuPage provides a hands-on approach to studying course material and also encourages students to pursue various clubs and internships available within a student's major. There are several opportunities for any student to get involved in and out of the classroom. Special transfer programs are also available for engineering students at College of DuPage, guaranteeing admission to select universities upon completing the necessary COD courses and meeting GPA requirements. 
engineering is everywhere. Intelligent and innovative people design and create extraordinary things every day in this dynamic and growing field. Engineer your future. Get started at College of DuPage.